dispute. Everybody was asking about Josh Rosen. Uh, Josh Rosen this, Josh Rosen that, Josh Rosen this, Josh Rosen that. I see a bunch of black people walk into one class. I know, what that, I know it's my class. With a blue backpack. With a blue backpack. What's the, what's the dumbest sport oh, <laughs> on campus? Oh my God. How's it going everyone? I'm Kevin Wei. I'm a student here at UCLA and I'm teaming up with my friend Olu Olorunfamni, number four on Bruins football, aka the running back who vaulted over a defender into the end zone and together we're bringing you a lot of original content. Every week, we'll share a perspective in a day in the life of a Division I football player from working out in practice to going to class to living in the dorms. We want to accurately share the student-athlete experience and give you an inside look into college football, a look that many students and fans haven't seen before. This is Day in the Life of a UCLA Football Player. Hey, what's up? It's Metal World Peace. If you're a high school kid trying to get into college or even a community kid at a JCC trying to get into college, you have questions, concerns about what it takes, the experiences, go to collegekevin.com and he'll answer all your questions. How's it going, everybody? I'm Kevin Way, and today I'm with Olu and Chase. Now, I know a lot of people are wondering what do D1 college football players do when they go to class, right? So today we're gonna find out. Where are we going, Olu? Going to History 140A, where we learn about history. <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> Pretty much. History. How we developed in America and how we settled and stuff in the beginning. Mexican Revolution, all of that. You have a lot of teammates in the class? There's like a lot. <laughs> There's a lot. Are we going to class just because the camera's here? Or like, do you guys actually go to class? Oh yeah, we go to class <laughs> every day. Really just show up, be there, do what you're supposed to do, honestly. That's really the main thing, do what you're supposed to do. If you don't do what you're supposed to do, you can have 300 burpee box jumps. Oh, at 5 a.m. 5 a.m. And if you don't, if you don't finish them, you have to come back and start all over again until you do it. So, essentially, it's not a good idea. I know there's a guy named Alteron Werner, 2010 UCLA. Oh, yeah. He got a bachelor's of science in mathematics, and he ended up playing seven years in the league. Is there anyone like that here who's like doing football um, and something that's like a super hard major, maybe engineering? Well, I know, or something like I know. That? Darius Pickett graduated in three, and he's. He has a political science degree already, and now he's working on a minor in African American studies. So shout out to him. I think I know one person that was like in medical school. I think a lot of our walk-ons do like engineering, medical school, all that stuff. What sport do you think is the smartest on campus? Football. On campus, yeah. football. <laughs> honestly, if honestly, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna have to go football because things that we learn, if you sit down and look at it, it's like smart, intelligent things. So, and the fact that we learn it, we have to know it. Just because we don't know like one plus, I mean like. 2x times 45 equals C or whatever doesn't mean we're not smart. <laughs> if we want to go off the books, I'll give it to the golf team. Golf team? Golf team. Because you guys definitely have the work golf ethic. Team. Work yeah. ethic, waking yeah. up in the morning. Oh yeah, we definitely have all the intangibles. I'll say that for a fact. All right, so you guys don't have to call out any sport if you don't want to, but what's the what's the dumbest sport oh, <laughs> on campus? Oh my God. Um, I, I That's tough. This is UCLA. Out. I don't really think there's a lot of. I don't think there's. Yeah, really if you're doing a dumb sport here, at least you're getting your education. So yeah. So, so do you, do you feel like you're getting like the the best education you can at like the number one public university? Of course, there's no question about it. This, like like we were just talking about, I literally have a seven to nine page midterm paper about one question. I have to literally take one question and stretch it for two thousand four hundred and fifty words. So. That's UCLA for you. Shout out. I don't know if it's true or not, but I know at other schools there are some super easy classes that football players take. Uh -huh. Is there anything like that here at UCLA? We don't got rocks for jocks here, no. Nah. Nothing like that? Nah, it's just are you we sure? partake. We literally partake <laughs> in what regular students partake in. So whatever they're in there doing, we're in there doing the same thing. There might be like less rigorous, but it's, there is no such thing. It's just easy. So do you have any advice for anyone coming in who's like going to be a football player trying to balance everything? Well, anyone coming into this school partake Particularly, just make sure that you're good on essay writing because everything you do at UCLA contains essay writing. Is that your teammate? Yes. Kyle Phillips in the building. Kyle. What's your name, bro? Kyle. Wide receiver. Wide receiver. There you go, man. We're filming like a day in the life of a football player thing. Right. What's been your favorite class at UCLA? I've only been here for a quarter and a half. I'd have to say the studies of the social organization of African American communities. I just found that class very interesting. What should I expect? coming with you to this class. Say a lot of, you know, factual things and then she'll probably say some funny stuff. Talking about her personal life. It's, she's a very interesting professor, so it's very funny to watch her sometimes. Very, very engaging. There's no PowerPoint. 
nothing. She's just literally sitting there. Cool, man. I think we actually might be watching a movie today. Hey, are we watching a movie today? Are we watching a movie today? Oh, I think we actually are. Let's go! We watching a movie! <laughs> yeah, here my guys right here. This. Swear to God! <laughs> All right, Scott. Oh, what's Bro, yeah. Mo City. What's up, right man? Here. Will. Will we'll lock it. H Town. Day in the life. Oh, day in the life of Bolu uh, Ski. Day in the life of Olu, football Olu. players. Oh, yeah? Football players. It's not only about me, it's about the homies, too. About the, you about everybody. We're about everybody. Class. You feel me? Class. Oh, you in this class, too, with us? Nah. Oh, oh, this one, I'm about to use the elevator, though. Oh, I heard that. Are you guys coming? Yes. yes sir. Yeah, we go. I love what are you guys' heard. names? I'm Will Lockett. You feel Will me? Lockett. I'm from Houston, Texas. You did. Reno Valley, California. Reno Valley, California. There's three members of the Scud. Real Brothers type. We have this little group called the Scud. Yeah. Scud. It's me, Keon. You'll meet So So later. Will Lockett. You'll meet Nate Matters later. Let's get it, boy. Let's get it. Oh. Smiling for like that. You got a camera. It's right there. You got a Don't professional photographer. You want to say hi? Hey, <laughs> Don. Tell me who you are first. <laughs> this is QB1 right here. Am I both for saying that, Devon? But I believe it. I believe it. Too. Believe it or not, you're pretty sturdy. You got some big shoulders, bro. I'm not afraid, bro. But if I did, if I didn't slip, I would have scored on that. Yeah, what honestly, we were slipping all day. Where's the food from? Practice. Oh yeah, show them what we be getting. This is all. I didn't go crazy today. Oh, we had way more than that. But we had way more than that, but you know what I'm saying? Little waffles. Oh yeah, he big timer right here. Yeah. 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 Turn camera. Yeah. Oh, you trying to control the camera? Are you trying to show me? Big. We're doing like a day in the life of a football player. Show you guys what everything is like here at UCLA. These people actually work hard on and off the field. No. Hey, bring your bros. Let's get it. Right here. Right here. Sit right here. Sit right here. What's up, man? What's your name? Brandon. Nice to meet you, man. Oh, yeah, you too, man. What's this you got? We're doing like a day in the life of a football player. Oh, for real? Yeah. yeah. Is it cool if you guys are on it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool. Where's, where's this going to be posted? YouTube. Oh, okay. What's your major here? Psychology. Psychology. Yeah. I was telling him that I know there's this one football player, Alteron Werner, mm -hmm. Bachelor's of Mathematics, and he ended up playing seven years in the in the league. Is there anyone like that on the team who's like doing a super hard major and they're doing like killing on the field? I mean, I think the last person was uh, Josh Rosen. Josh Rosen. Who he majored in our business. Econ. And now he's about to be in the league. Oh. Shut up. God knows how long. Brandon didn't say his name for the smart people. Brandon be doing physics and all that. Like, look, he got all these notes and stuff. Like, like, you know what I'm saying? Gotta stay organized. You feel me? What's that been like? Oh, it's difficult. A lot of formulas? It's, yeah, it's, it's hard. Newton's law and stuff? Mm -hmm. I'm grinding it out, though. We all here, though. I like that, man. You brought the whole team to the front. As long as we're doing the right thing, Gotta right? sit in the front. One hour later. I can't believe you sat through that whole silent movie, man. That was insane. It was silent first. We just got out of class with these guys. And Keon's actually in physics with Brandon. Facts. What are you learning right now? Circular motion. Centripetal force and everything. Yes. How do you know this? <laughs> How do you know this? <laughs> I took physics, bro. Oh, you did? For real? Yeah. Oh, I got a quiz today. What's this whole um class check thing going on? Class check, you either got to be in the first three rows or coaches act like you're not there. And if you're not there, it's a punishment. You get in trouble? JP, tell them the punishment for not being in class or being late to class. Oh, for late to class or we don't go to class and we have 300 burpee box jumps in the morning at 5 o'clock in the morning. Yeah. Which, I don't know if you know what that is, but it's the worst thing the whole time. This sounds bad. It's the worst thing the whole time. The worst thing. You don't ever want to get that. Where's your next class? It's uh, Humanities. Is it that way? Yeah, it's this way. Alright, my class is in voice. So. I'm gonna go up to Jan's though. I've never really go gone up to Jan's step. <laughs> Have you ever taken these steps, like, just to actually go to class? Yeah, when I'm late, I gotta run up these, bro. Really? Yeah. See, no, I, I avoid these at all costs. Really, honestly, I don't even think I went up these steps to class. They're just too much for me. Where do you usually go to study? The building. Um, I went to the, um, the library. The Wasserman building? Mm-hmm. Been to the, I go to Powell sometimes. Mostly my room. Always my comfort of my own place. Just, just lock in there. and start reading and stuff? Yeah, pretty much. Especially typing essays. That's majority of what I do here. Look at this view, man. This is one, one heck of a view, though. It's really beautiful out here, though. I'll, I'll, I'll tell you that. What's your next class? Afrofuturism. An example is Black Panther, Wakanda. That's actually what the class is named after. It really just makes you think in a different way. The thing to media, 
into um oh it's cool. <laughs> I'm having a little tour here. Yeah. My bad. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> We're just bumping into everyone no, today. When it comes to tours, that is insane. Like, I remember one time I was walking in class and a whole big group of kids were like literally just all around me. I couldn't even get through. And then the, the, the little tour guide ended up asking me, if, like, oh, do you play football here? And I was like, yeah. So he said, could you talk to them for a little bit? I was like, oh, yeah, for sure. So I asked, they were asking me questions. Like, when I tell you, everybody was asking about Josh Rosen. Like, oh. Uh, Josh Rosen this, Josh Rosen that, Josh Rosen this, Josh Rosen that. I'm like, ah, I don't know, I don't know. Yeah, it may be rigorous, but at the same time, look around you, like, look at where you're, you're attending, like, look how beautiful this place is. Like, even though walking up hills may be, like, the worst thing ever, just looking around, just looking at the environment, that looking at where you are, like, it just makes you think, like, well, I made it here. Yeah, look at this. Yeah, so, and I'm walking backwards, yeah, filming yeah. this. Never learning. Oh. oh. Hey, who's, who is this? That's Bozo That's number four, good. Chip on his Pro shoulder. Way. How we doing? Chip on his shoulder right there. Wanna come Bozo. join us? You wanna come join us? Let's get a little, uh, oh, yeah, you little know what? Bozo. This Buster for himself, Bolu. Yeah. Chip nah. on his shoulder. If you didn't know, now you know. Nah, it's Mr. Pro Way. <laughs> the only way. <laughs> nah, we Darn just, they homes. We just joined God's creation out here, you know. Amen. I, Beautiful I follow, day. I follow Jackson. Jackson was laying down, so I laid down. Jackson, what are you guys' names? My name is Darnay Holmes. Darnay Holmes. Pleasure. Pleasure. Nice yesterday. to meet you, bro. Jackson Gibbs. Kevin. Nice to meet you, Kevin. He just got out of class. Did you guys just chilling here studying? We just had a discussion, actually. We about to get ready for I mean, another class. class. Yeah, yeah, we had class at 12.30. Oh, okay. Yeah. Cool. The life of a student athlete. I, I get where you're going. No, here. we grinding, dog. Yeah, every moment you get, I mean, just gotta lay down sometimes and uh, gotta enjoy a good can. day. Oh, you know? Man, you can't be focused on your routine every <laughs> second of the day. You know? <laughs> Live every five minutes. Shout out to Coach Kelly. You know? Every yeah. five minutes. <laughs> Shout out to Coach Kelly for that one. Oh, Chip yeah. Kelly said that? He yeah, said Chip that. Kelly yeah. right there. What's your major though? Mathematics. Mathematics. Yeah. Yikes. What do you have to take? Like, what do you take? Like, it's, I don't know. I come in, started taking calculus, multivariable calculus, uh, linear algebra, and then it goes, it goes into like different stuff. So that goes. Does that go into like engineering or was that? I'm doing so. Like, I did two summers of software engineering because uh -huh. I chose to take more computer science classes. Yeah. And then now I'm doing product management. Okay. Um, I'm working on like two projects right now with Metal World Peace. No so way. that's cool. Yeah. I was I was telling him like. Um, we should do a video with him if you so want to. Product, well, we gotta product do some management videos. such as like oh, so you create apps. Yeah, sure. Or like I like manage the creation apps, of apps. apps yeah. Hell yeah. Yeah. Now that's that's something I'll definitely link up with you. I'll get your number after after you're done shooting. For sure, man. That's it for part one of this episode. For part two, going over to Bola's channel. Yeah. And we're gonna do that.